Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy John for the Game of Duty here. Welcome to you back to another episode of the Saga Lock. Hopefully you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful day. This should be episode 215 of the Saga Lock. And in today's episode, we get to fight Joy. So I was, this last episode I was like, oh, you should probably figure out if I should turn off the experience share, blah, 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 blah. Our level cap's 37. So we should not have a problem dealing with that. Um... You know, worst case scenario, like, 38 I'm okay with going to, but 37 is our level cap, guys. This is gym 3 that we're talking about, and there's a 10 level difference between 2 and 3, essentially, which is insane. I just would not have expected it. If you would have told me that, hey, by the way, your max level cap at the end of the game is going to be flirting between 74 and 75... I would have said, girl, you're lying. Nope. It's... It depends on how I want to play this. Also, thanks for making that a... Uh, does that uh, make all moves uh, electric type or just normal type moves? We'll find out. Um, what? Leftovers. A lefties? Freaking... Okay. But yeah, so, yeah. Um, after this, our next gym is 39, so it's really not that big of a difference uh, between this gym and the next gym. But afterwards, it's like, holy heck, was Batman. But yeah, we kind of have a similar situation to what we did last episode, where or the last time we had a gym, where it was like, you go to the gym, flirt with some encounters, and then, yeah, so... That's kind of our agenda today, is flirt with some encounters, figure that out, blah, 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 get surf so that we can freaking have a good move on Tentacruel. Also, just realized I didn't change the layout for the second time in a row. Yes, we can. I didn't, I was, didn't, right now, actually, part of the reason why I'm recording so late is actually because I'm doing my laundry. Um, and so it's like, I don't want to go to sleep while I do my laundry. Oh, Samson, hi. And so because I don't want to go to sleep while I'm doing my laundry, I'm just doing it and recording, because why not? Perfect timing. Um, hmm, Samson, you create problems, and I don't like that you create problems for the team. Samson over here just making life miserable, I swear. Good job, Samson. Okay, I'm going to switch into this. So... Tentacruel is gonna have Tentacruel is gonna play a weird role right now in this fight, and Samson's a good Pokemon to test this role on. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, Toxic Spikes, Acrobatics. That's an interesting move for you to have, Sammy. I don't like that. That's um, if that was a move, if that was that, I'm assuming that's not an itemless Acrobatics, just with how much damage it did, but. I mean, if it is an itemless acrobatics, then oh boy. Oh, well, that was a nice crit. Good job, Sammy. Oh, jeez, that does nothing. Um, acrobatics is what you're clicking. I'm gonna send in Nick. You know what? This is the setup for what I wanted to have happen. So, come on, Nick. Acrobatics, that's going to do nothing. It's actually, you're going to get chipped more than uh, it doing actual damage. And honestly, this is a perfect opportunity probably to do this because you're just, you're, you are just tapping acrobatics because that is your best move against me. Perfect opportunities for me to just kind of slowly chip away. Brine. Ooh. Joy said, uh, enough of that. <laughs> and I say, that's pretty fair. Also, of course Samson would be the one to miss this that move. Because, of course. <laughs> you know, can't land it against, you know, the only Pokemon I can't land it against is Samson, because, of course. That's just how this works. That's going to create more havoc than it should have, because, yeah, I need, I need that poison. Oh, wait. Is that physical? It is not considered physical. 
Well, no, it is. It's just not considered a contact move. So I think that's Samson Musa then Acrobatics, um, Water Shuriken for priority, and I already forgot the other two. Brine, which Brine makes sense honestly for Joy to carry. So. Watch in typical freaking AI fashion, I can already see it right now, just playing right before my eyes. Poison type. Seismitoad. Oh, that's cool. Come out, Jolly Roger. <laughs> Another thing that Jolly Roger can actually like murder the crap out of. I'm I'm very very surprised at all of the stuff that Jolly Rogers is just even with its limited move like line, the amount of stuff that it can just kill the crap out of is insane to me. I feel like it's like am I actually using Jolly Roger or am I using a different Pokemon? Is kind of how it feels. Moltres. That's a Satan Pokemon. Because it's a flying type, and so it won't get, or it won't have the effect of the toxic spikes. In the, ooh, wait a minute. What if Nick decided to learn gravity? I just thought about that. If Nick chose to learn gravity, gravity would bring the flying type to the ground and force toxic spikes upon it. Dude, Nick would be so, or not Nick. Um, oh yeah, no, it would be Nick. Nick is the one I would want to have that actually, because. Dude, that'd be so much. That'd be so crazy. It's just straight up, like, Nick, Nick, just... Let me just make sure that I do double damage to you right now. Blah. And it's like... It, and it makes... I mean, it does. It sets up for a lot. Oh, Heal Bell. Satan wants to learn Heal Bell, though. Like, of course, it's Satan that wants to learn him. I like this moveset, honestly. It's... It's... It's, it's an odd oddball moveset but what's interesting is seeking um is i was talking about it or thinking just thinking about it just now if i trick or treat into a shadow ball it's doing the same amount of damage as two shadow balls would so, it's a good way to preserve power points as well, if I did it that way. Color change. You are now a grass type. I'm fine with that, actually. I'm 100% okay with that. But poor Seeking having to have that ability, but... Works for me. It's dead now, but yeah. So, I'm very curious as to how a lot of that stuff is going to go like because again it, it is a way that i can conserve power points and i should utilize ways to conserve power points like that like if i have the option on the table always conserving 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 so it was so strong i could feel powerful the bond between you and your partner is losing is frustrating but you most definitely will be able to make it evolve your pokemon i'm sure of it we are all winners after seeing that amazing battle between Joy and John, or in this case, Joy and Shady Penguin. But yeah, I'll be waiting at the gym. Okay, Karina. Oh, we will we actually no? That'll be next episode, right? We like right? That's how this works. It's crazy because we like a lot of the gyms get crammed into like this s this pseudo section, and so it's like boom, 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 boom. Like we we've talked. To, I'm sure you've heard this many times if you've seen players play this game. Um. Nope, real is too slow. Cool. <laughs> Thanks, game. I actually do appreciate that. Um, because I'm was not planning on that so that would have been a huge royal mess up if that got went wrong but anyways this gym is a gym that requires you to uh to fight everybody so it's
it's one of those fun ones. Okay, bye. I don't have... Oh, I do have a lot of money. A good amount... Or not a lot, but a good amount of money. Enough to where I do feel comfortable in buying 10 Hyper Potions. It's half my money, but I do feel comfortable doing that and expending that. What do I have in here? TMs, we have... Oh, well, that's getting purchased. It's another double battle move, and I need that. Oh my gosh, this is actually a really good mark. It's got Joy's favorite move, too. Um, it damages all except for the ice type. It's literally hail. Okay, it doesn't. I forgot it doesn't tell you that. Um, Dizzy Punch I don't need. Night Slash, is, Night Slash will be awesome. So that's another easy one. And then try attack. I usually don't spend money on that, but it's it's Diamond Storm. Like, somebody's got to learn that, right? Well, well. Okay, Garatina. <laughs> be your double battle saint, I guess. <sighs> I guess if anybody was going to learn it, Diamond Storm freaking on Garatina would be the play here. But Hex is so good. Yeah, this is where Trick or Treat goes away. <laughs> that's where the meme. That's where the meme of Trick or Treat ends because it's Diamond Storm, right? Like, as much as Trick or Treat is an interesting conceptual move, like, realistically, am I getting rid of Shadow Punch for that? No. I'm, like, it's a, my physical ghost stab, and then it's like, am I getting rid of freaking? Uh, my 130 base power move on it? No. Why would I do that either? Um, because, like, literally, having a team straight up built to just do double damage to status Pokemon is funny. Here, have nothing. I forgot they don't give you much in this game in that, in that regard. Um, roller skates? Why can't I use my roller skates? That's why, because it was the hat buttons. Okay. Like, why can't I use the actual, like, essential game mechanic? <sighs> Yikes. Okay, Suicune's a problem. Ooh, I said the demonetization doggo's name. Whoopsies. <laughs> I, ha I just had a moment where I realized I said that, and I was like, well... That just happened. I guess I gotta use Satan here. Honestly, here's the thing. Like, this... <laughs> it's so cr It's still... It's... Every time it pops out as a shiny, I'm like, Oh my god, I can't believe I got a shiny. Like, the shinies... I don't get shinies often, but the shinies that I tend to pull are kind of ridiculous. Like, this is a great example of... What the heck is this ridiculous shiny, John? Um, moment. It's either that, or it's super bad and literally a hot garbage trash. And so, like, unless it's shiny log, where of course you're gonna get shinies. You can get a lot of different shinies because that's how the shiny logs work. Oh, Shadow Punch just missed. So yeah, so it's kind of hilarious to me when when that happens and you're just like, okay, like I would not be surprised to get a shiny like demonetization doggo. Um, at some point, because of course I'd get a shiny demonetization doggo. Oh, you know what? You know something about Trick or Treat that I didn't think about? I mean, in this case, i actually glad that I kept Shadow Punch, but also, Trick or Treat made it so that I could get around Wonder Guard. It wasn't my other Wonder Guard to get around her. It was just... 
That's a mistake. We'll see if that costs me in the run at some point. Because knowing my luck, it will. Because, yeah, Trick or Treat. I mean, it is a ghost-type move, though. But I believe it... Um, well, I guess, technically speaking, then, if something was, in fact, a normal type that had Wonder Guard, then I still wouldn't be able to deal with it. Well, I still have a lot of ways to deal with the Wonder Guard right now. Honestly, I mean, that, that's part of the reason why I built the team the way I did. Um, was to deal with the Wonder Guard problems, because, well, Wonder Guard's in this game, and Wonder Guard's a problem, so dealing with both of those, I figured it was like, let me figure that out. Also, speaking of figuring things out, I haven't ran into an issue recording right now. Interesting. Because this, this, like, I, this is the second episode in a row that I will not have encountered the issue. If I don't encounter the issue. Oh, shoot. There we go. That'll be crazy, though, if I end up not encountering the issue after freaking complaining about the issue. Um, Flareon. We're leading with Nick. So, honestly, I'm going to switch out into my, uh, my water type. Because we have a water, like, uh, we don't have a very diverse team, but we have an interesting team. I think that's what makes this team very fun is because even though it's not diverse, it's just plainly interesting. Ooh. Oh. Um. Bye. Tentacruel. Of course, of course, Tentacles is like, I'm just going to get murdered by two not very effective freaking hits. Bone Rush. Wow, you would have absolutely been murdered from that, no matter what I did. Um, we're diamond storming you. Goodbye. Get out of here, freaking Flareon. I tried to use Tentacool on you. I tried to be nice, but you said no. Oh my god, wait. I just realized the diamond storm is going to have a, like, a high chance to boost Garatina's defenses like this Pokemon needs defense buffs or anything. Oh boy. Oh, that's actually really good. Um, forget Sludge is may also poison. This is also should be may also poison. Yeah. Oh. Goodbye, Sludge. We like the 90 base power one a lot better. Grand Bull. Well, you know, I would like to... Actually, we have freaking Nick. I, I would like to be able to use Sludge Bomb, but you know, I just casually just can't right now. Well, yeah, you can't, but it's fine because you have... Yeah. You have Nick. Nick exists. I know Nick only has Venishock as an attacking move, but it's super effective as is. Flame Wheel. Oh, plus the... I forget... I'm forgetting about that Rocky Helmet chip that's actually going to come in, like, that's come in clutch twice now. Having the amount, like, cause that's a big chunk of Rocky Helmet chip. That's, like, not a small bit of chip. It's one-eighth of their health or something like that, or one, it, it might be one-sixteenth, but still, it's a chunk. Um, and to be able to just take hits phys from a physical force like that, it's, like, crazy. I mean, even then, that feels like that wasn't... Well, I mean, 1,200 versus... I think it's 1,400. So, I mean, I guess it is worth it in that sense. 36, 36, 34, 34, 36. Everybody's 36 except for freaking... Oh. I mean, does it... Oh, it doesn't matter anymore. Okay. Cool. I think we have one more of this. Bum, 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 bum. I can't attack this. That means I know what Pokemon I'm gonna send out because there's only one answer to that now. That is a Satan O'Clock. I mean, it really is Satan O'Clock on that. 
there is nothing else that I can think of to actually attack with this, or use to attack this with. <laughs> Poor Meowstic. You're gonna get Shadow Bond into Oblivion. Are you actually, again, crazy that these Pokemon that I feel like should have died just aren't dying to this kind of stuff. It's like, this is the Shadow Ball from a Giratina, and you're just like, I'm just going with this. Like, even if, like, we are matching levels and stuff, this is an old Grisius, this is a Grisius Orb Origin Form Giratina. How are you living this kind of stuff? Especially a Meowstic? Like, what the frick? How? Is a great answer. I would love an answer to that question. How? Well, shoot. Oh, that's it. Okay. He's just gonna walk in circles. Cool. I can rectify my mistake and just use Satan to complete this journey and go along with it. Hi! You've got a, some impressive skating skills in order to have caught up to me, so you won't just, you won't show up what in battle though. Like did he just say that we're not gonna be good enough in battle? But okay. I mean, you just must, uh, dude, imagine saying that, though, to this kid, and this kid, you go, you're not going to be good in the battle, though, and then this dude pops up with a shiny origin form Garatina, and you're just like, I would be shell-shocked if that ever happened, just like, boop, I got a shiny origin form Garatina, and of course, and the thing is, is in the Pokemon world, because remember, I'm talking about this in the context of the Pokemon world, that is crazy talk, because not only is there only literally one Giratina in the world, how in the world did you get the shiny one at that? And then two... It's like, you have the Garatina. Three. This dude has a male combi. And apparently has no idea that that thing will never evolve. And it's literally pointless. <laughs> this dude had so much confidence to have absolute hot garbage. Oh, we're getting, we're getting more random moves. Cool. 80 base pop. What? Hyperspace hold. You, using a hyperspace hold, the user appears right next to the target and strikes. This also hits through detect and protect. Wow. What's weird is I have not been using frost breath, like, at all. It's 90 base power, 90 base accuracy. But I've been using it in, I've been using this, this lowering speed in favor of it, which is interesting. But they do the same damage, so I'm gonna get rid of Glaciate, I think. What's the other one lower? Oh, the other one lowers attack. This guarantees lowered. This does not. So, I'll get rid of that, actually. I'll, I'm okay with the 5% miss chance. Oh. No. That, I don't see that as as big of an issue. Even though Haze would be nice on this Pokemon, I just don't see that as an issue. Jirachi. I, oh yeah, that's right. It's I, I almost did the thing again where I was like, oh no, I have nothing for this. Ghost is super effective. But okay. 
sure you have nothing for this, John. Dude, it still did not kill. Wow. Again, this is shocking the crap out of me. What Satan can and cannot kill? Like, what in the world? Oh, there's, that's there. That's what's going on. Okay. Yeah, like, I mean, Satan's level 35 now, but with 160. Dude, how much HP is Satan going to have? Wait, if Satan already has 160 HP at... And arm, I mean, you're not going to let Satan live to see the end, but, like, I'm curious how much HP Satan would have at the end of this run, because 160 is kind of a lot, as is. Like, most of my mods have half of that. Well, I guess everybody's over 100 now, but 160 is a lot. I'm going to go ahead and continue with the way that I'm going to do it. What? I Oh, actually... For this fight... Oh, shoot. I might poison Barb. Let me see if there's any other thing. We're doing this. Hey, time for Lady Karina's big appearance. Yes, it is time for Lady Karina's big appearance. Find out what she has. Because we're getting another gym badge today. This is our second gym badge today, actually, now that I think about it. That's funny. I didn't think I'd have another one well, today, as in, like, day of recording. Um... Tyrantrum lead. Well, I know I'm automatically switching out because this is a bad lead for me. Um, and it was just Karina, so it's just a random person. Okay, Nick. You're going to have to do your job without... Oh, actually... Could I, in theory... I'm going to test my theory. It is a gym battle, but I'm testing my theory. Could I, in theory, set up one layer of spikes and then get out of there? Because I'm going to have to get out of there because it's a tentacle rule against the freaking thing. But could that work? I don't have a fairy type to just block the outrage. So we're going to get damaged upon, but... I mean, that's probably not going to do as much. Oh, Jesus, Louise. Okay, we're getting hit again. And I, again, I'm playing it safe. I don't, I don't know what my ranges are and stuff, so we'll just play it safe. I'm glad that I did take the risk, though, and toxic the one. Oof. Oh, that's that's good. Now it's confused. Rolls wise, that looks pretty good. I'm gonna caught in the garden. Hopefully, I'm faster. I am faster. I just didn't want to take the risk when I was pretty much I could have died for taking that risk. So yeah, there we go. Stepped out of confusion to outrage again. Here's the thing, though. I've got Rocky helmet. <laughs> Are you kidding me? You've got to be absolutely freaking kidding me. That was literally the only way that things could have gone awry. The literal only way. Otherwise, 
It did the range. We literally got to see the range because it brought us down to 59 from 122, which was 60. 60 would be 119, 63 points of damage, and we were at 68. So 63 divided by 4. It would have been doing 15 maximum. Like, really? Really? Game. I I have no words for how frustrated I am with that. But Nick was faster, so what's Nick's stat? 80? Oh, boy. So Dino's faster, Hentai's faster, Jolly Roger's faster, Satan's faster, and Pincushion Cat is not. Like really, of of all things, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, I'm pissed. I am pissed. So I'm gonna do it this way, even though this is the not honorable way. You piss me off enough, you're getting it the not honorable way, okay? Fuck you and your fucking crit. Like, are you kidding me? Like again, the crit is the only thing that matters there because a crit does. Like we said, we saw 63. Um, points of damage, so it would have been ninety something. So I guess if I, again, I guess if I would have healed, the damage range did not matter at that point. And you know what? That is a totally fair assessment. But the fact that the crit happened, it's the, the, the it's that right? Like that's the frustrating thing because it's just like, oh, I clicked the wrong move. It's like what? So yeah, it's the simple fact that crit happened. Also, this confirms that she does not have a... Uh, that wrong move actually costed me a lot. Okay. This confirms that she does not have a, a, a thing that is can clear the spikes away. So at least the spikes were worth worthwhile. Jeez, I'm so... St oh, can we not? Can we just not get crits, please? That'd be great. You know, that's the th second one you've secured. Woo. Again, we're doing it the non-honorable way, and I, I get that. I'm totally... And then you come out with an oddish. Freak you, dude. Thanks for making my entire freaking stuff pointless. <sighs> I'm frustrated. You know, you're not supposed to go to bed angry. But yet, here we are. We're going to be going to bed after this episode. And I'm going to be very angry because I lost some. I lost a mod to BS, per usual. If I'm losing a mod, it's to BS a lot of the time. And you know what? Good on the game for providing the BS it definitely needed to, like... I mean, clearly it needed because everything is just getting boob-doodled, but... Will this turn this into an electric type attack? No, it goes through it. Ooh. <sighs> so aggravating. To that of all things. Shell smash on Dino? <laughs> nope. Sorry, Dino. You do not need shell smash in the slightest. 38. Igly buff. Oh, that's kind of that's kind of funny. I'll give credit to that. That's hilarious. But I lost Nick, so uh yeah, that we're just doing this this we're doing it this way. Oh, level thirty six. Did I say that that was the ace? No, thirty seven is what I said the ace was. So does this game not round up? I almost forgot about that actually. Yeah, this confirms game does not round up. Okay. The fact that that's the only Mon on her team. Oh, that's very aggro. That's very maddening. All of all Pokemon.
why is why did both Nick and Naruto be the two that what, like had to go? Can we just explain that to, for one quick second? The two Pokemon that I have genuinely lost in the run, unless I've lost more, I might have. Also, Flatter's um, not good. I do apologize for making you lose your Pokemon. Well, good. I deserve like a hundred apologies after what you just pulled. Like, you murdered Nick. Of all the Pokemon, or all the people that you would have, you could murder, you murdered Nick off of a crit. I mean, I guess I'm sure that everyone was like, yeah, we kind of saw that coming. Like, if well, any Pokemon was going to die, you take the most risk with your defensive monster. Like, well, yeah, it's a defensive monster, of course. Yeah, no, the literally the only two Pokemon I've legitimately lost is Nick. <laughs> Nick. And, wow, okay. Oh, it's that's funny. That Pokemon is actually carrying the uh, evolution for the another fairy type, so I have access to both of it. Um, hmm. Overcoat lacks. I don't have the evolution thing for you, but like you could also be definitely a good Pokemon. Because I mean, you're ground and rock, which we don't have either type, and we keep talking about like I kind of wish we were ground type right now. I've said that like a bunch, and I know that for sure that I've said that a lot. The thing is, is I mean, you're a special attacker, you're physically attacking. We have a lot of physical attackers. Don't need another one of you. Careful with Frisk, but you're another physical attacker. Motham is interesting, but it's a flying type. Baltoy, I don't think evolves yet. And of course, Raikou's always an option. <laughs> hmm. How many times have I said, do I need to grow? I need to grow. They would be great to have a ground type right now. Because steel is a big problem on our team right now. But also, because you're part rock, you are also weak to steel. So, will you actually help with steel? Not really. Honestly, KD would help with steel more. KD's moveset's just absolute garbo, but... but Katie would help with that more. Let's see. But you're going to be grass fighting. So you're going to be quad weak to flying. You're going to be weak to psychic. You're going to be weak to fire. You're going to be weak to like 800 different types. Is it worth Mr. Shroomish Man? <sighs> or is it better just to go with the Kong Kelder? Even though, like I said, I need special attacking Pokemon. Hmm. Picking Shroomish, I mean, to be fair, we're like in the mid-30s, so most of these Pokemon will have their fully evolved form at this point. I mean, I guess with that said, Mace wouldn't be bad either, because 
Well, well that's plus speed minus special attack on a Baltoy. Or, so that's like the worst thing for Mace to have. What's Naive's nature? It's plus speed minus Bidef, which honestly, again, for this Pokemon, its frailties are f enough anyways. So, yeah. I'm choosing KD. Fighting is going to help us with the steel typing. Then you have the grass typing in a nutshell that's good against certain types. Um... Bug will be a problem, but not necessarily because we have Dino. Um, then we have... Yeah. I mean, because if I'm looking at it, what does Fighting Super Fight... Rock, that's right now kind of an issue on the team. So we'd have uh, answers to that. Ground. we Ground is our only water type is weak to that. So this would be a resistance to that. Yeah, there's too many benefits to having freaking this Pokemon. So yeah, we're doing it. Shroomish, getting added to the team. Well, hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. Hopefully you guys, you know, did all that stuff. Like, comment, subscribe, all the fun stuff. And we'll see you guys in the next episode. Um, when we trek our way to the next area um, of the game. And actually, we have encounters to get here too. So we got one, two, then three. We have one, two, three, four. Ink four encounters, and then we have five, six encounters. It's gonna be an encounter filled day tomorrow, so yeah, we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.